Woodland Stopovers, um, located just north of uh, 15 kilometers north of Francistown on the A3. Um, we feel we are ideally situated. Um, we're close to the brand new airport that will be open soon, the new stadium. We also um, are very close to, well, we're the only hotel or, or facility, self catering facility, that is north of Francistown. So people can refuel and um, replenish themselves in France town, come stop over with us and then head north to the uh, tourist destinations of Botswana. Woodland Stopover has um, been given its name after the Woodlands Kingfisher that migrates here annually. So we expect to see them arrive early November when the rains, when we anticipate the rains coming. And interestingly enough, they, they come and they seem to nest in the same nests every year, have their little babies, raise them, get them to fly, and then they fly all the way home in about March, April, back to North Africa again, just to prepare themselves for the journey again in November. self-catering facility. We have three different kinds of accommodation on top of camping. We have the basic camping facilities where people would bring their own tents and camping um, equipment and we have a basic um, uh, little rooms on the other side, basic chalets which would use the same facilities as the campus, the pollution facilities. We have lovely upmarket rooms, river view rooms that overlook the Tati River. They self-catering as well with their own bathroom en suite and a little kitchenette that they can use those facilities for. Okay. Where we are standing now, where mm -hmm. our, our property is sited on the old Hunters Road, um, and that was uh, the route that the hunters and missionaries used in the old, and the explorers used mm -hmm. in the old days to get to the Victoria Falls. Um, it's no longer a track in its entirety now, but on this particular spot there's a hill behind me that they used to use as a, as a marking point and then uh, further up towards um, Pandamatenga you can actually get onto the Hunters Road again and follow the route which is the boundary, the border between Botswana and Zimbabwe. So we just have um, a, a little a wall at the top that, is, that remembers those folk from then, from that time and we also are marketing a wine that um, we have labelled the old Hunters Road wine just in remembrance of them and, and for our customers too, as they're explorers into Botswana as well, the tourists. So it's just to, to acknowledge their visit to Botswana as well. I would like to encourage people to come and visit us and see what we're about and um, to see that we um, have a beautiful facility here in Botswana, even though it's just outside Francistown, outside a busy city that's full of hustle and bustle and noise. And we've created a lovely bush environment, a lovely bush setting with beautiful facilities. And we would encourage people to come and have a look and see for themselves um, and to just enjoy the tranquility that we offer. Mm -hmm.